found me! <laughs> Thank Matharu. I thought I'd die here, the last of Cone's settlers, alone. Nella and the foragers were out when the Tuatha came. It was a massacre until they returned and drove them off. She and the others set off for Verki, where Anella said they came from. If you've got any hope of finding her alive, you'll get there quickly. Verki, head south through the narrow pass, then turn east. If you want to help her, you'd better go now. She promised we'd rebuild Colm. Should have known that was impossible. <laughs> Can't blame her. We chose to come here, hoping that war was far enough gone that we might rebuild. All around you, this was Colm. It might have been again, but now everyone is gone. Damn Tuatha. Anyone who could fight had left to forage. When the Tuatha finally came, there was no one to resist. After ten years spent wandering the plains, we thought we could rebuild our homes. How could we be so wrong? When we arrived, there was nothing here. Then, like a second dawn march, they were everywhere. Why do they hate us? They're not like the other Fae. It was after the Tuatha's first defeat in Erethel. They were scattered, but regrouped south of Tewili. Under cover of night, they marched north, and with the dawn attacked Rathir. General Telera's forces cut them off and drove them back into the sea. Stronghold in southern Tewili, mostly destroyed during the war.
So, you made it. Remember, there's more than just your reputation on the line. I hope you're ready. Right. Looks like there's a lever on my side. Looks like it opens something on your side. Remember me! Made it through fine, I see. Time to return the favor. The way forward is blocked. Can you see a lever on your side? Remember me! There's a problem. I can't find a way forward anymore. I didn't see anything that would help us. I think you're up again. Is there anything on your side? Remember me!
Looks as though you made it, at, despite what the Hierophant predicted. So much for a vaunted prophesying. The door opens with two pretty good things to finish this. Time to get back to the office. What are you looking at? What? Ah! It burns! It's... I can't move! This is side to take in. My own little dove, all grown up and robbing this place with no care for want nor cause. Took a bit of doing to track you and poor Phasma down here, but when I heard what job you were on, I had to find you. I've been off in the dark for a while, dove, and I'm sorry for that. After all, you did for me an own stand. But I had to go underground. I had to do a little digging, and I found a bit, dove. I found quite a bit. I told you the Hierophant set me up. Well, just in case you had any doubts, the Hierophant set you and Phasma up as well. Think, Dove. True, Phasma ran his mouth about the Hierophant, but you're a separate case. I did some digging. The Hierophant sees all, knows all, so they say. Except you, and that makes you a threat. You were both sent here because the Hierophant knew at least one of you would be cursed. So I came to help. We helped Paul Phasma. I heard the job would take you to Rhythm, and I learned about the amulet. This gem should be able to negate the curse. Give it to Phasma, will you? It's most likely what's behind this insurrection. Some amulet of Telogris disguised as a gift. Always check a gem for flaws, Dove. The Hierophant had it in for me, 
meant to see me on a noose for not being a quiet little servant. So I left the travelers. I guess as long as I got a message, it didn't matter if I was dead or not. Hierophant's mistake. I had to learn what I could of the Hierophant, and that all brought me here. To you. Strange place, ain't it? The old captain here got fed up with the army's incompetence, so now they're in revolt. Use that gem I gave you on the amulet that cursed him. That should set him right again. I didn't know what would happen. But you saved me. And Grimm's here. Grimm Olwig? They, they said he was dead. You. You should speak to him. It looks like you're the one he came for. Let's move. Good to see Phasmus back among the moving. Let's make sure we don't let the Hierophant get him. If you see Irian, tell him Phasma died. But on to other things. You've been running around these lands like a good traveler, Dove. But now, I have a job for you. We've all tasted the Hierophant's malice. Now let's make sure we return the favor. I got a plan, Dove. We're doing more than getting our revenge. We're removing the Hierophant from power to rule the travelers no more. The Hierophant meant for me to die while stealing a certain book, the Missives of Sable which you traded to the gnomes for my freedom. I can think of no better weapon for my revenge, but the gnomes have hidden it away. I need you to steal the glass of ambient to help us locate it. It's in an old Irathi ruin to the south, called the Blackened Hall. Between you and the glass is an army of demons and three tribes. To bypass the trials, I left you a gift at the dungeon's entrance, Buru's boots. Those, along with the amulet you and Phasma stole, should help. The glass is powerful, Dove, and well guarded. But you're the only one who walks free of the Hierophant's gaze. It's all up to you. There's the Isle of Flame, where any who aren't quick on their feet will burn. Use Buru's boots to tread safely through them. Then there's the Dark Maze, a labyrinth of hidden paths. You'll just have to find a way through, Dove. Lastly is the Guardian. They say it's a demon that can't be killed. But if you use the Rhythm Amulet, you can curse it like Phasma was. It's in the Blackened Hall. Place has a nasty reputation of being, well, a death sentence. The trials within aren't insurmountable. I nabbed a few familiar items to help you with them. Buru's boots and the Amulet of Rhythm. You've got your work cut out for you, Dove. And I have mine to do as well. Let's get moving. Nasty bit of ruin from what I heard. Legend says an old king reigned there with his wife. Wonderful too, I reckon. Halls of flame, magical mazes. But it's a bad ending. His wife was a monster all along. And by monster, I mean demon. So the story goes, at any rate. We'll take a thief of good class to break in. And I think you're just the fit, Dove. Here's the Isle of Flame, where any who aren't quick on their feet will burn. Use Buru's boots to tread safely through them. Now then there's the Dark Maze, a labyrinth of hidden paths. You'll just have to find a way through, Dove. Lastly is the Guardian. They say it's an Iskaru that can't be killed. But if you use the Rhythm Amulet, you can curse it like Phasma was. The story goes that they're drawn to the glass like thieves to a jewel. Wouldn't doubt it. 
the hall is a strange place by all accounts. Supposedly, they thought the glass could help them see, but the Guardian will let nothing near. Magical treasure, crafted by the Arathi. Once owned by the King of the Blackened Hall, and now guarded by his Queen. We can use it to find the missives of Sable, and the gnomes have that book so well hidden, there ain't no other way. I thought you might need to rely on a bit more than your odd luck on this one, Dove. So I got you Buru's boots and the Amulet of Rhythm. I meant to get the Master's pick as well, but sometimes, Dove, you have to make do with your own hen's eggs. Now, use them as you wish, but they ain't got much magic left in them, so be warned, they won't last you forever. An Iskaru, Dove. Legends say she fooled the King of Blackened Hall. Slipped in and took it right over. Through swamp and ice, desert and wood, was the exodus from frozen lands. Upon each hill the priestess sang, and closer to Erethel they came. The people walked in groups, the future houses of Rathir, planning the lives of gold and silver, music and laughter. Lush fields and streams Tyrion described to farmers, the first makers of the bread and food we eat today. The mages that awaited Lyria's touch now reap her power.
magical power. I achieved everything and anything I desired, except to find one of them again. And inevitably, someone would remind me through their ugliness that somewhere, something as beautiful and perfect as that divine spirit existed. People will hurt you. People will try to use you. But this thing was different. Yes, I could trust it, and it would protect me from the callousness of others. of magical power. I achieved everything and anything I desired, except to find one of them again. And inevitably, someone would remind me through their ugliness that somewhere, something as beautiful and perfect as that divine spirit existed. People will hurt you. People will try to use you. But this thing was different. Yes, I could trust it, and it would protect me from the callousness of others.
That's the glass of ambient, then. Nicely done. And it says the missives are... Hmm, very interesting. I'm saving that for another time. Now there's one piece of this puzzle missing. We need to find out who the Hierophant is. And to do that, we part ways, for now. Your path lies in Sun Camp, to the south. Lay low, take some jobs, and we'll end this soon enough. Act inconspicuous. The Hierophant's still watching, and will learn that you survived, but not that you suspect anything. While you're there, speak with Camp's leader, Arjean, and get some work. Hopefully, it will distract the Hierophant. I'll find you soon enough. Nah, she's quite a harsh one, but mostly harmless. I blame it on the sand what's out there in Detir. It's not like here, Dov. The heat's enough to kill the smile on a traveller, and there's not a lot of shade.
out for the General's Welcome inspection. Welcome to Howard Grind, say. You're accepted here to this key. That Freeman bastard they drove up lucky mine? Well done. Real war sworn work, that. And here's your gold. Good day. The locksmith pledge shield Fenin, you say? Stole my key, had it copied, handed it to the enemy. We must confront her at once. Hurry! Henry! Seize her! Pledge shield Fenin's in the cells now. Go see if she'll talk. We've got to get to the bottom of this. Yes, yes indeed. The duty's yours. Hardly fair to hold her accountable when my own key was stolen. Best to forgive and forget all around, I think. What concerns me is whether anything else was stolen. It's not as if I've got an inventory of what's down there. I ought to have worn the damned thing around my neck. Or stationed guards outside my quarters. Never thought it would come to that. I think she will tell us what she knows. Every month, more free men making trouble somewhere. I know I can never make amends for the deaths I've caused. But I will try. I stole the key and had it copied. I gave it to... He swore he worked for the Arthar army. That this could end the war. I did. I saw what I wanted to see. His name is Elbin Merrock. I knew him from... But that does not matter. He said he's a soldier in Tewili. Though we always met pretty far south of the barracks, near the way into the marsh. In the army, as I said. The only place I've ever seen him is with his friends, where Tewili joins Akatha. I knew Elbin from... From a time before the war sworn. When he first came to me, I wouldn't even speak to him. But he kept at it, telling lies, offering hope for an end to the war that has so troubled my heart. That's what the mages in Brigand Hall called themselves? I've never heard the word before. Gryan was a mentor. He was my champion, and I betrayed him. My sister, my brother, all fought and died in Chloricon. I thought what I did would help end it, not let slip Niskaru and Dalantarth. Oh, what have I done? Stealing the key was the hardest part. Every moment I was sure he would return and notice it missing. Once the original was returned and I had the copy, there was nothing to it. No one suspected quiet little Livia. Armor shined. Given this turn of events, you are to find this Merop character. Extract from him what you can. I have other work for Gwyn. Meet her in Rathir when you're done. First I will have her tend to that vault. High time it was cleaned and catalogued. After that, these mages call themselves Falangi, right? I'd like to see what kind of footprints that name leaves behind. Follow the trail, Wallsworn. Someone copied that key and stole who knows how many artifacts from our vault. Go as far as you can to find them, and meet up with Gwyn in Rathir. Did you see the look on her face when we seized her? Hard to tell if it was more fear or relief. Or the army. Help with the war. My gods! Miscaru stole an artifact. 